What is support and how do we use it on purpose? I define support as the skillful act of resisting the outflow of breath. So if we take a regular breath and just do, it's more than I can say, but I'll try it. We're gonna, we're gonna get on the throat because I'm just releasing breath indiscriminately. My voice is unsupported. Everything's just whooshing out, okay? But if I take a breath and suspend that breath, it's more than I can say, but I'll try anyway. Now I have control. Ah, I can move the voice where I want it to go, even dealing with sinus and allergies. And I'm only pointing this out not to make excuses, but because I know some people feel like if you have like a stuffy nose or whatever, you can't sing. Yes, you can if you have support. So how do so how do we do it? Um, try this. I'm gonna give you a feeling here. Can you take a regular breath and let it whoosh out? No trick, just let it whoosh out. You feel how easily it whooshes. Just notice that. Can we take a regular breath again and then make an F sound as in fun or fantastic? It shouldn't whoosh, it shouldn't whoosh. It should slowly lead. And we're not pushing, we're just making an F sound. So suddenly instead of, I'm getting suspension, meaning that part of, I keep using this word suspension, suspension is the evidence of support. When we are supporting well, the rib cage becomes suspended and it kind of seems to be floating in place. I'm not fighting for it. I'm not squeezing for it. I'm not pushing for it. It's just kind of gently aloft and supple, almost like a eagle riding on thermals or like a, I don't know, like a hang glider kind of thing. So I'm not, I'm not pushing. I'm just letting it. So if you do the F, it naturally stimulates this resistance. So here's the key. So how do we actually use this in singing? Because the F creates resistance, my body cannot just forfeit all the breath right away, which means that muscles have to engage. So when you're Fing, ask yourself, what am I feeling? So if I take in breath and let it out on an F, that suspension is not just happening by magic. I feel pressure. I feel pressure. I feel some pressure. Like study your body. What are the sensations in your body? The skill is emulating, replicating those sensations at will when it's time to sing. Here's some stuff to play with. Play with the intensity of the F. You'll notice that, see in the A approach method, my method, we teach reflexive support, meaning we allow the body to respond to what the voice and what our intentions are doing. This allows for a very supple, natural kind of support that's not like locked. So if I do a gentle F, I get gentle sensation. If I do a slightly more forceful F, just still keeping the throat soft, I get a firmer sensation. If I want to give sound to the F, I would use a V, which is basically a voiced F. When I try to, why do I just feel it's words anyway? I can use a V in place of song lyrics, okay? But then this is the key. You've got to study the sensations. La, can I keep the party going as I open up to a vowel? La, la. And I'm giving, I'm pressing fast forward on this essentially, but this will take days, weeks, months, years for you to master. Everybody's different. Some, I have students who catch on to it in a single lesson. Some people take longer, but if I know the feeling I won't preemptively run to this. I'll, when I try to, why do I just feel it's words anyway? And I'm paying attention, like what's going on? I'm not just trying to sing notes. I'm not just trying to be loud and powerful. I'm practicing with a question mark and I'm asking, what do I feel? One thing I tell my students a lot is that beginners and singers who struggle with their voices, they practice with an obsession over how they sound. Masters practice with a question mark. What do I feel? If you can tap into the sensations, you can ultimately make whatever sounds. Ah, 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 
You can make whatever sounds you want. I'm a little Ariana Grande. You can, you can make whatever sounds you want safely and healthily and reliably, but you got to feel. So use the F to feel the resistance and study. Pay attention to what your body is showing you and learn to summon forth those feelings at will when it's time to actually sing. If you want way more details, breaking this down step by step by step, please go to airapproach.com on my website. I give so many details. I also have group classes on Zoom. I'm doing a Build Your Basics course. We're meeting on Zoom every Saturday in the month of September, I think. So go check that out on airapproach.com as well. You can work with me directly, sing for me, get feedback, or don't sing if you want to. You can keep your screen blacked out. Just throwing that out there. And until next time, peace. I'm going to go take some sinus medication or something, but yeah.